Welcome to part 11 of this series. So far, we've covered health checks and resource quotas. In this video, we'll address some questions related to Helm charts. Without further delay, let's dive into the next set of questions. The next question is to create a Helm chart named Nginx chart that deploys an Nginx application using the Nginx version 1.24.0 image. Configure the deployment to run with two replicas. Set the memory requests to 300 megabytes and the memory limits to 500 megabytes. Once the chart is created, install it with the release name MyNginx in the Nginx Helm namespace. Okay, let's go to the cluster. Before we begin, let's check if Helm is installed. Yes, Helm is installed. Let's run Helm create command for creating the chart. Yes, Nginx chart has been created. Let's get into the folder. We can see couple of files and folders. Let's get into the template folder. Here you can see resources UML files like deployment, service, etc. Let's check the contents of deployment. Here you can't see any values. And the values are expecting from outside. Which means values are passing through a values YAML files. So let's close and find values YAML file. In order to modify default values, we have to edit the values.yaml file. As per the question, we have to make two replicas, so let's change to two. Image version should be 1.24.0. Next we need set resources. Memory should be 300 megabytes and limit should be 500 megabytes. Perfect. Let's apply this Helm chart. Let's install the chart. As per the question release name should be MyNginex. Oh, we have forget to create the namespace, so let's create the namespace first. Okay, let's install now. Yes, Helm chart installed. You can see revision 1 here. Okay, let's check the pods first. Yes, two pods are deployed. Next, we need to verify the resource. Let's describe the deployment.
perfect, request limit and image versions are correct. OK, we have successfully completed the first question. Let's go to the next question. The next question is, a Helm chart named Nginx chart is available under slash root directory. Install this chart with the release name MyNginx under Nginx Helm namespace. After deployment, update the number of replicas to 3 using Helm. Finally, roll back the deployment to release revision 1. OK, let's go to the cluster. Let's check the namespace first. Yes, Nginx Helm namespace is available. Next, we need to find the Helm chart. Helm chart is available under root directory. Next, check the deployment file. As expected, there is no values. It should pass from values.yaml file, so let's open the values.yaml file. Here we need to update, but as per the question first we need to install this chart without making any modification. Ok so let's install Helm chart first. Yes, our Nginx chart has been deployed. Let's check the pods first. Yes, pods are running. Next, we need to find the revision, so let's run Helm history command. So far there is only one revision, as per the question we have to upgrade this Helm chart with Replica 3, that time this revision will become 2. Ok let's do it. I'm going to change the replicas to 3. Let's upgrade the chart. In order to do that we have to use helm upgrade command. Yes our deployment is upgraded. OK now we can see three pods are running under Nginx Helm namespace. Let's check the revision now. Now we can see a new revision too. As per the question, after upgrade the deployment we have to roll back to revision 1. So in order to do that we have to use rollback command.
Congratulations, we have successfully rolled back the release to revision 1. Yes, we can see there is only two pod are running. And one more revision has came in the history. Okay, this is the end of this video. We will cover gateway API related scenarios on the upcoming videos. Thank you for watching. See you soon.